We should have plenty of daylight. Let's hope we have plenty of piles. Let's see, today we're trash picking right about somewhere in here, somewhere. Just in case you guys were interested. Ugh. Look at the whole world in my hands. Wow, that is a fancy vintage laptop-like device. We'll take it. I'll hold it between my legs. That's weird. When have you ever seen a COS DVD player? I'm taking that just because I never heard of it before. Anywho, I saw a bike in someone's yard around the corner. So maybe we'll get to go grab that. Or maybe it's just some kid's bike. But either way, welcome to trash picking. Here in a beautiful, rich town on a sunny day. The bike was a bust. But I cleaned two big smears of uh, goop off of my lens. Wonder how long those were there. Let's see. Hair shampoo concentrate. What other kind of shampoo is there? Ziff all purpose cleaner. Want some lunch? Hot dog. Oh, that's adorable. You know what that is? That's a suit for your dog. So you can turn your dog into a hot dog. Let's see, anything in here? Nope. Look, I maybe shouldn't have even gotten out at that pile, but you know, I'm trying to rack up clips early before the sun goes down in six hours. Look, it's the baby. Is that a baby though? Or is that like, like a kid? mirror is pretty sweet. Can you see anything with it? Just don't look in my direction. Look, it's a little swan. This is the dichotomy of me doing this. We have this lovely ruffled edge hobnail milk glass and then a big chunk of rust off some scrap metal that I picked up last night. All right, we've got some birdies, which we don't need. Oh, this is the best thing ever. Not quite. What do you guys think is cooler? The, the brass pineapple that I just found? Let's get it in the sun. Or that brass bull that I found a week or two ago. I hate to say it, I, I'm giving it to the pineapple. Let's see, what else we get in here? Another little birdie? Cheep, 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 cheep. Look at these birds. Cheep, 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 cheep. All right, I guess I'll take the birds. I'm afraid they're gonna get broken though, but here, we'll put them in there for somewhat safekeeping. Then we got this thing we don't want. We got the Ziggy. 
I think we can live without that. Oh my god. These little brass finials can just go for scrap. But look at this. I don't know, I mean like maybe that usurps the pineapple and the bull as the coolest thing I've ever found. And look, it's got like little weird diagonal demon eyes to it. Quack. Yeah, we're finding all kinds of crazy stuff today. Or maybe I'm just easily amused. You got half a pool stick. Whoa, boy, oh boy. Good thing about these rich towns is they usually have nice faucets. Look at the faucets in this. You can tell from the back, they're all brass. Look at that. I have found so many sinks with crappy faucets, but. Come here, Spidey. A spider. He wants to like get out, but I don't want to hurt him. Come here, get on my hand. There you go, buddy. Oop, there you go. Anyway, what were we talking about? Yeah, it's a nice heavy sink. Those faucets are really nice too. So that's good. Thank you, Rich Town. Let's see what we got. The Avigo. No thank you. kind of nice maybe we'll do better over here in terms of the bikes what do we got nope saw we Ooh, Bible songs all right uh, I guess everybody in the whole neighborhood had a crappy bike. I really can't believe how much stuff we've found so far, even though it doesn't seem like a lot. Considering how early it is and how lightweight this town's been lately, I'm excited. I'm especially excited about this thing. Where's the handle? Are you telling me it doesn't have a handle? Damn, that is a cool little TV, isn't it? Look at that. What are all those letters for? I don't want to drop this thing. <laughs> look, look at this. That's another thing about this town. Even though it's a pretty rich town and people throw out cool stuff. The cord cutters here are just savages. I mean, including me, but... Like, I would never have cut the cord off of that thing. But, uh... You know, you'd... Oh, a whole box of Ticonderogas. Made in Mexico. Goodness. Wait. The American original. Proudly made in the U.S. Now, it's not the American original. And it's hecho in Mexico. Yeah, I'll, sh I'll shut up about my, like, you know, in the, in the old days, a Dixon Ticonderoga was made right here in the USA. Ah. But if you grew up when I grew up, you know what this is. You know, we would take these tests in school where you had to fill in, like, a bunch of little, like, a little bunch of little 
dots or whatever you call it, you had to have a number two pencil. See? Their garbage took me down memory lane. Is, is that your title? Is that your thumbnail? I wasn't gonna record this one, but now I guess I will. Let's see how DuPont Corian smashes. Oh, it smashes pretty good. Ow. Seriously, don't ever do that in someone's driveway. It's such a mess. All right, I'll put the pieces back off camera. It was very satisfying though, wasn't it? I don't know why I'm getting out here, but this yellow thing looks neat. It is neat. It's like a school locker. What do you think is inside it? Probably the key, right? Well, I have failed miserably at my goal of stacking clips before the sun went down, because it's going down. I just had to show you the street, so I wouldn't show you anything else that you can't see. Anyway, we still have some daylight, but it's not looking good. It's looking like we're probably going to be shooting video in the dark. That's what happens though. This time of year. Ugh. See? See like the bluish coloring? Like you look over there, it's nice and, you know, it's warmer. Anyway, on the bright side, talking about light, no pun intended. On the bright side, it's not even hot today. It's like 80 degrees or something, so. The sun goes down earlier, but so does the temperature. Nobody in this town knows that I do videos. And there's two pickers right around the corner, so I gotta be careful. But these are neat. Little flowery things. That's not neat. My door is locked. I checked the door and it's locked, so easily made my way through the window. Look, this one's got a butterfly on it. That one's got flowers. That one's got an acorn. Listen, I have to pretend I'm excited about this stuff because uh, it doesn't look like we're gonna make any money today. So, I might as well have some fun, right? Right, Uncle Sam? How does Uncle Sam talk? It's easy to do like cats, they just go meow, but... Anyway, I guess... Uh, welcome to the USA. Is that how he talks? All right. Nothing good in there. See, oh look, it's my cooler, right? That's my same cooler that I have. And there's some candle holders down there that we don't really want. See, the Coleman Jr. And that's like the big brother. I don't know why that's so uh, fascinating to me.
All right, so uh, five hours later, this is what we got. It's like we, we could have stayed home for the last five hours and had the same load. I think this is a sewing machine. Sometimes in these wealthier towns, you get neat sewing machines. This is the Patty LaBelle. Oh, and it's not a sewing machine. It's a slide projector. Wow. Right, Mr. Ant? Am I stupid? Hmm. Is that a thing we need to have? The Patty LaBelle slide projector? Uh. How does it work? It smells kind of weird. I don't know, I guess we can take the Patty LaBelle. I might actually look it up though, just to see if it's worth taking. Anything else in these bags? Nah. All right, we'll research the rebel, the label, and then we'll uh, let you know, and then we'll find some more junk and wrap it up. All right, the label is a no-go. Too bad, how sad. Somebody else will grab it though. That's what I can call this video. Taking things out of the trash and then putting them back. Oy vey. All right, we're causing a traffic jam on a main road and these people have their address right in front of their house. So. Is that all my videos are about? The logistics of getting in and out of the car and not showing you people's addresses? Wow, those are heavy. That's a brass niblet. Should have brought my clippers. All right, I'm gonna take this with me. Really? Is that happening right now? All right, I'll go get my clippers. Oh, I found these bike wheels, but I couldn't really show you that either. All right. Look at the pavement. I am so vigilant about maintaining folks' privacy. Because it's nice enough that they let me dig through their garbage. Last thing that I want, you know, is to blow up their spot and have them be like, why, why you do this to me, Mr. Trash Picker? I was so nice to you. So, I try to be a responsible citizen. And in return, I get a carload of junk. Ish. All right, we're gonna wrap it up here. So what we got is the stuff in the trunk you just seen. These things, the little birdies, how much do they cost? Oh, they were cheap, 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 cheap. The best thing I ever found, which is the brass pineapple, the best thing I ever found, which is um, Quacky the Duck, quack. 
a mirror, a laptop, a CD player, and a TV. And a locker. And I wish I could get that open because I'd put the Dixon Ticonderogas in it. Anyway, spectacular as always. I'm sure you guys are impressed. This is what I did with the last eight hours of my life. But I gotta get out of here before I get ran over by one of these many, many cars. And so, until next time, wish me luck and thanks for watching.